friends welcome to our channel trending places today we will showcase you dubrovnik croatia pearl of the adriatic dubrovnik is a croatian city on the adriatic sea in the south it's famous for its unusual old town which is surrounded by high stone walls built in the 16th century the baroque city Blaise Church, Renaissance Sponza Palace, and Gothic Rector's Palace, now a history museum, are among the well-preserved structures. The pedestrianized Stradung, or Placa, is flanked with stores and restaurants and is paved with limestone. Whether you're visiting Dubrovnik for the first time or the hundredth, the grandeur of the old town never fails to inspire amazement. It's difficult to imagine anyone growing weary by the city's limestone avenues, baroque palaces, and endless gleam of the Adriatic, or failing to be inspired by a stroll along the historic city walls that have safeguarded the capital of a sophisticated republic for centuries. Despite the fact that the shelling of Dubrovnik in 1991 shocked the world, the city has rebounded with vigor to fascinate visitors once more. Take the cable car up to empty senior. Exhaust yourself climbing up and down narrow lanes then. Plunge into the azure sea. Marvel at the interplay of light on the old stone buildings. Trace the peaks and troughs of Dubrovnik's past in museums brimming with art and artifacts. Take the cable car up to mountain. The magnificent city of Dubrovnik, dubbed the Pearl of the Adriatic, provides a plethora of intriguing things for you to explore. Dubrovnik was created in the 7th century and has been ruled by the Venetians and the Hungarians throughout the years, each leaving their stamp. The city grew at its fastest throughout the 15th and 16th centuries as evidenced by the spectacular architecture and UNESCO World Heritage Site classification. Popular for its spectacular seafront location on the Dalmatian coast. Coupled with its evocative and historic old town district, Dubrovnik is home to Croatia's artistic and intellectual elite and offers numerous cultural activities and festivals. Dubrovnik's old city walls are one of the city's most well-known characteristics. Now more than ever thanks to its appearance in the blockbuster HBO series Game of Thrones. These powerful walls as high as 6 meters in sections and up to 6 meters thick were built in the 10th century and modified in the 13th and 14th centuries to provide a sturdy defense against invaders. Dubrovnik's city walls, which stretch for about 2 kilometers and give multiple magnificent views over the Adriatic and inwards over the old city center, are a great sight for a casual stroll. Walking about its attractive old streets and lanes while visiting such wonderful sites as its splendid cathedral and treasury, the long Stradung pedestrian walkway, and its many fine old palaces and fortifications are among the highlights of a visit. A walk around the ancient city walls is one of the most memorable aspects of any visit. The best area to stay in Dubrovnik to view the city's key attractions and absorb its rich history is near the pedestrian-only old town. If you prefer a more tranquil setting, the Lepad Peninsula about 3 kilometers northwest of the old town, is a wonderful choice. With numerous high-end hotels offering spectacular views of the sea. Hope you liked the video. We have more than 150 videos on trending places. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching.